Hey, pretty gang, it is Jen, your exclusive startup business coach, and I want to come in and talk to you guys about a couple of business ideas that you need to be trying for 2021 online. First thing you need to know is this video right here was brought to you by my 50 point checklist for the brand new business owner. So if you are a brand new business owner looking to start your online business, you definitely want to go in the description below, check out my 50 point checklist. Let's get into it. So the first business that you need to think about looking into is credit repair. Okay. The great thing about credit repair is that you can get credit repair courses online and you can um, definitely get with a credit repair specialist that will train you as well as has a um, has a group or has a point of contact for people who are interested in your services. I'm going to be leaving somebody that I'm going to be recommending in the description below. Um, uh, something that you can do to go ahead and solidify yourself in the credit report credit repair business is let people know that you specifically help people clean their credit up for the main two things that a lot of people want to buy, which is either um, home or uh, loan approval and or car approval. Um, I've seen uh, some of the investments to start a credit repair business um, start from $500 and up. And there's some smaller other ones, but I like the ones that cost a little bit more only because it usually comes with a network of clients and a network of other credit reports credit repair specialist. Okay. So that's the first thing. The second thing is notary. Okay. For those of you guys who do not know, I have another video. I'm going to link it below and I'm going to let it slide up here. And what it is is that there is um, now they're allowing for some states, not all. So make sure you're checking for your state. They're allowing for notaries to actually take place online now. Yes, ma'am. Online. Okay, so go check out my other video where I talk to you about Ron remote online notaries. Okay, the great thing about doing the online notary is you can get it throughout your whole state and cities near you. Um, also, for those who want to make sure that you are getting your best bang for your notary buck is um, doing regular notary. It's great for more of a side hustle money, but if you are looking to turn a notary into a full blown business, you definitely want to look into becoming a loan sign agent. Now. For those of you guys who are in the state of California, I have a playlist. I'll leave it in the I'll leave it in the description below where I tell you how to become a notary in the state of California for under five hundred dollars. Again, I'm going to be leaving a notary that I'm going to recommend for you to go ahead and look into as somebody that you might want to learn and get training from. Okay. The next thing is tutoring, you guys. You want to definitely look into tutoring. Um, the thing about tutoring that I'm loving right now is that. Tutoring can be tutoring for a specific subject, but more so what people are needing help with is how to work some of these online platforms and how to make sure children are turning in their assignments and they're doing the things that the teachers need them to do. Um, and also training the parents so parents know how to work some of these online programs. How are they supposed to be checking on their children? What are their children doing? What do the children need to be doing? How they should be responding to the teachers? So it's definitely something you want to look into. Um, and the great thing about uh, being a tutor is that um, for those of you guys who are local to some schools, you can probably get a contract with the school and or this city. So it's definitely something you want to look into. OK, the next thing that you want to look into, you guys, is coaching. Yes, I am all for coaching, fitness coaching, life coaching, dating coaching. It is a phenomenon right now. For those of you guys who do not know, I am also a coach, a fitness coach in particular and fitness has blown me up. For those of you guys who do not know, make sure you're checking out my other channel, gojambifit.com at gojambifit over here on YouTube, okay? But life coaching is popular. Dating coaching is popular. Again, I'll be leaving some of the people that I believe that you should be learning from if you're gonna be getting into life coaching or dating coaching. I know another popular coaching that is popping right now is femininity coaching that is on fire right now. So if you have expertise in any of those areas, definitely look into it. The great thing I love about coaching is you can do coaching online and in person. You can do things like events, write books, do trainings, do support groups, do um, group coaching. There is such a vast majority of things you can do with coaching. Um, and for those of you guys who do not know, I also have a video about <laughs> consulting, how to set up your consulting agency. You set up a consulting agency pretty much to be a coach. Okay. So the next thing that you 
definitely want to look into becoming is a resume writer. Yes, if you know how to write creatively, if you know how to write professionally, if you know how to write persuasively, you definitely want to look into resume writing because as you guys know, where we currently are in the world, people are in need of a new job or maybe in need of a second job. For, for some of us, we have been out of the employment um, search for so long that we need to brush up on some of our resume writing, okay? So if you know how to do resume writing, you definitely want to get yourself on LinkedIn. Definitely let people know that this is what you do. Also, if you are a creative writer and know how to do resume writing, you can also write for people's social medias. Yes, this can be for profiles such as um, dating profiles, Instagram profiles, Twitter, all of that stuff. If you know how to write copy and, and you um, grammatically know how things look and how to persuade people, definitely want to look into becoming a resume writer. And the last things but not least, I definitely want to go ahead and have some honorable mentions, okay? So definitely, if you are looking to start a business in 2021, definitely want to look into owning a boutique, an online boutique in particular. Um, also, get into an affiliate marketing. I should have a video around here or drop in soon or it should be there where I'll tell you, you know, is affiliate marketing worth it in 2021? And also, for those of you guys who do not know, I have my own course, Braid Hair for Cash, where I show you how to take your braiding skills, package it, and become a boss braider, okay? So you guys, I hope that this was helpful. Again, these were a couple of business ideas for women for 2021. Um, make sure you're liking the video. Make sure you're hashtagging Pretty Gang in the comments. And I'll be talking to you guys later. Bye, you guys.